How's it going, friends? My name is Jesse, also known as Moral Support, and welcome to Pokey Rogue. Uh, th this is my first foray into this uh, phenomenon that has apparently started in the Pokemon community. I've seen it a little bit, uh, not really do dove into much. I've just seen it glances of streams and videos and such, but just enough to uh, to get my my interest up, right? So um, I'm a huge fan of Pokemon, obviously, um, but also of roguelikes and roguelites in general. Um, big fan of Hades and Hades 2 just came out in early access so I'm really excited about that and I've already put in quite a few hours on that um but things like um Rabbit and Steel just came out I've just tried that one out um Risk of Rain all those sorts of things. uh Emerald Rogue the, the other Pokemon roguelike I, I put a lot of time into that as well so what I'm trying to say is I enjoy roguelikes a lot um so this is kind of directly up my alley um so I wanted to give it a try and just record my first experience see what it's like so let's go ahead and start a new game i already filled out uh some of the information and then decided that i wanted to uh record this so uh i think first i know that this is a common a common pick for one of the first starters to start out with just because sword song is crazy so uh i will also be going with play coco because i think that's crazy and i was thinking <laughs> i was thinking about it these three might be the best starters to start with, uh, just because the the um, the signature abilities I think are just crazy for it, right? So um, yeah, I'll, I'll I'll refrain from doing that for now though. Um, I am a huge fan of Greninja and Pokey, as I think everybody in the Pokemon community is. Um, so I and I don't know if hidden abilities get a thing or get unlocked later on i don't know if that's what the passive thing is um but we'll go with brokey just because type coverage things like that um and i guess for my last one it's just for type coverage and maybe still a little bit of bulk maybe let's go with turwig um yeah that sounds good to me uh let's try that here and get that to start and let's start it up let's see what what goes on here Okay, so we're just starting with the Wurmple. Access the menu, press M or escape while awaiting input. Menu contains. So, okay, cool. And we're just straight in with it, okay? Well, that's should be an easy kill. Okay, cool. And I think we get rewards after every encounter, right? Yeah, okay, cool. So, we're after every battle, you're given a choice of three random items. Isn't that... Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> it's, it's giving me the instructions for it. I was like, that's not what a word does, right? I thought that's what we get every time. We can use such solution items to transfer held items between Pokemon using the transfer option. The transfer option will appear in the bottom right once you have obtained a held item. Okay. So we can only swap held items. I guess that makes sense. In between every battle. Uh, okay, cool. Be sure to buy these before you pick a random item. Uh, progress. Buy them before you go. Okay, cool. So we gotta buy, if we're gonna buy something, we gotta do that first and then pick the lure. I accidentally just took the lure. I thought it was, okay. Well, I guess we're running double battles. Um, we switch for Coco? No. Switch for Oki. Don't see why. Do I have Pokeballs? I do. Can I catch the Shroomish? Okay, I gotta, okay, it's just like normal Pokemon. Uh, let's. Merc the shit out of this uh, Pidgey because I want to kill this. I want to not buy, not kill. Catch, good God, Jesse, get it together. I want to catch the shrewish. Uh, cool. So we'll just. We should just be able to. Yeah, this should be fine, right? Cool. Shit. Didn't catch Pokemon with a hidden ability. Quick feet. I don't know if that's actually going to be good for me. When it evolves, I can't remember if it changes or not. You would think with 20 plus years of Pokemon experience, I would know some of this shit by now. Okay, what do we got here? A baton. Allow passing of effects by switching Pokemon. Wait, that's actually nuts for Play Coco later on. What, or I guess it would be Skeletors. Because if we get Torch Song boosted and then we can sw swap it out with Baton, Charm or a Nugget. We don't need any of that yet. We're going with Baton. That seems like a crazy pickup. I'll just go ahead and toss it on Play Coco. I know it's early for that, but might as well, right? 
Uh, no, I will not switch Pokemon. And I'll probably catch the Vinipi too. It's my understanding that you do want to catch, um, catch a lot of Pokemon early. Resist across battles as long as your Pokemon are recalled. Oh! Recalled the trigger battle and pull the button. Okay. So we use stat changes and Pokemon on the field. Holy C or shit. Okay, cool. That is kind of mm -hmm. crazy. As, uh. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of crazy. Um, it's even more so with, like, Torch Song and stuff and be able to swap that over. But it could also screw us over because things like this. Uh, or things like Growler. That's also something that lowers our stats. Okay, I like this. This is a, this seems like a more... I guess a more intuitive approach to the roguelike Pokemon genre than Emerald Rogue was. I did really enjoy how Emerald Rogue was set up, but this feels... This feels more like one. I guess Emerald Rogue felt... Emerald Rogue, Rogue felt hard. And I've seen a lot of people are struggling with this, because I think it's like a lot of shit. Um, but we'll see. I guess... We're just going to grab some Pokeballs for now. I'm not exactly sure how much money is going to come into play. Um, I don't know. We'll just keep these guys out. I'm not sure how important it is to be swapping out Pokemon either. I guess it's something we'll find out after this first run. Um, I don't really have any interest in catching these, though, like I said, I... Yeah. I think I've heard that it's important to be catching things, but I don't know. I don't find myself in need of a Rattata or a at any point in the near future. Or in the distant, to be fair. Okay, so now I might want to look into buying a potion, right? Or I can just get a free one here. There's a chance to kind of be a double level 5 dollars. Uh, I don't really guess I want that, especially in these first areas. Um, and that also, see, doing the lure, I know I accidentally picked one earlier, but doing the lure, that seems like it's going to really up the HP that we lose. Um, so I think I'm just going to go with the Hyper Potion here and just toss it on Point Go. Um, oh, the Vinipi does have health still, too. Doesn't heal your Pokemon after you catch them. Okay, good to know. Okay, I'm glad that I swat or that I healed them if this is the trainer battle. Well, the buff should be easy for us to take out here. It is faster though, which is gonna suck a bit. That round, okay. Like I go is quite round. Okay, cool. Blaze activated, so we got that kill first. So we got the kill in one shot. Okay, so what happens after a trainer battle? Just another thing. Okay, let me spend some of this money, maybe. Heal. Oh, wait, I'm about to get healed up, aren't I? I'm gonna... Just for research purposes, I would heal Vinipede, but I think I'm just going to grab this because I think I'm about to heal. Okay, I didn't heal. Okay. Uh, I mean, do I need to be swapping out for... I guess so. Like I said, I, I can't... I can't determine right now if swapping out and switch training, basically, or spreading out experience is going to be important. Um, that hurt. It does seem right now we are only getting experience on what the, on the Pokemon that we're sending out that are not experience sharing, so that's something. Uh, double battle for 10 battles. See, I just feel like that's going to make our... Maybe, maybe there is some hidden um, benefit to doing double battles. I guess I know, like, double the Pokemon, double the catches, right? Um, but as far as, like, preserving HP, I think it's going to be bad. Small amount of money. Small amount of money. Okay. Um, let me do... I mean, first, let me heal up Froakie. And then, let's just do money. 
Lulu. I feel like that's going to be a good catch. That's one of the few, like, normal types that I think are going to be a good catch no matter what. Uh, switch Pokemon? No. Let's keep this guy out. Let's just toss the ball. I, I know... Now that I know that it doesn't heal Pokemon. Okay, cool. Bloody Fluffy. Hasty nature, which really is actually terrible for Lulu. But I think if we catch multiple of the same Pokemon, it allows us to choose between the natures that we've got, so... Uh... Depends if all party members miss it. That sounds really good, actually. I've got enough Pokeballs going. What's this? What's happening? What? What was that? What's happening? Okay, that was weird. It logged me out for a second, so we're back on the Lulu, I guess. Um, I'll just catch it first try again. That was so weird. Why did it log me out? Okay, good to know that it keeps the seed the same, too, because we have, <laughs> we have the Fluffy and Hasty one earlier. I guess Fluffy is all the time, but we have the Hasty one for that as well. Is this the same? It is. Wow. Okay, so the seed is completely the same. Don't crash on me again. Okay, cool. Uh, Ivy, this is our rival, right? There you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. Did you forget to say goodbye to your best friend? You're going after your dream, huh? Yep, you know me. Sitting at home playing Pokemon by myself is the dream. That day is really today, isn't it? Yup, yup. You know, forgive me for getting me. I didn't even know you existed, Ivy. Um, make the battle one. Cool. Uh, get all your, uh, uh, just battle me. Stop talking to me. Uh, battle me. Sprigadito. Uh, we're going to swap immediately, which I think it reads, right? It, okay, no. I thought I had seen that the AI was good, or it was a lot better in these, but I think that might be, might come into effect a little bit later on as well. I don't like that he's fast. Okay, see, it is a little bit better. It's swapping out on me. I mean, Ember's pretty good anyway, still. Cool. And now I'm in Blaze range. Is this going to kill me, though? I mean, I'm in Blaze range. Let's see. I know I'm obviously going to kill it in one shot. I just can't remember. Or I know it's faster than me, too. I just can't remember how much damage it's doing. So let's risk it. Okay, cool. Got yeah, level 8 for a lot of these guys. Okay, cool. Yep. Yep, totally cheated. Okay, I care less and less about what you're saying as you continue to say it. Super EXP charm. EXP all. Ooh. Okay, that's what I was needing. That's what I was looking for here. So we're starting to do... Okay. Uh, let's tag. Okay, I'm remembering in one of the few videos that I've seen for this, that we get healed after this. Right? Oh, we can reroll for 252. Um, I guess I'll go ahead and heal just to be safe. Because everything else kind of sucks, but I think we get healed here, don't we? No. Okay, so we just don't get free heals. Or there might be another encounter later on that I'm not thinking of. Uh, let me swap Froakie out. Oh, no, wait, I have e EXP all now. So I don't need to swap Froakie out. I was going to swap to turret wave for this, but I guess we can just continue to do this. Okay, so those are going to stick until I swap out now. That's kind of the crazy thing, because if I, I can press this... Yeah, okay. So those should those stat drops should carry over into the next uh, into the next fight as well. I probably should be conserving PP as well. See, it's so weird swapping from like normal Pokemon thought process to to this, which is something I had to get used to in Emerald Road as well. Super EXP charm, increase the EXP gain. Oh, that. That just seems like a no-brainer, because now I'll have two of those? Am I understanding that correctly? Yeah, I have two of them now. That's nuts. This is a boss Pusiana. Okay, and I do still have the attack drop. So, let me swap out... Uh, 
you know what? I could just get a clean switch. Let me let me do this Venipede. Let me get a clean switch, and I think I'll be able to revive anyway. Okay, so it does stay in my party. It's not like Emerald Rogue where it takes it out of my party immediately. Um, I am gonna go back out to play Coco. Okay. Speed Rose. Wait, why did it Speed Rose? Is it just a boss mechanic? Or did I miss something? Okay. Well, that was a very easy boss right now. And the XP all is happening. Very good. I got another experience charm, so now I'm getting a shit ton of experience. Okay, so here is where we get healed. Are we at the end of the... St oh, so after the boss is where we get healed. Good to know. Good to know. Okay. And our level cap is increased to 60. So we do still have a level cap. Even though I have all this extra experience, we are still working with a level cap. Uh, no, let's... Let me catch this. Because maybe... Maybe Payday works in here? I assume it, I assume it would. Technician and Impish? That's okay. Party is full. Release a Pokemon to make room for Meowth. Ooh. Okay. So we can... Okay, cool. Uh, let me get rid of... Let me just get rid of Shroomish for now. Because we have the grass type already. Um, but I don't think this... Um, this Meowth will be on the team for long. So I'm wondering how things work in between runs. I'm assuming levels get re yeah levels got to get reset and everything like that. Um, and I think I saw on the front page that it was only it was probably only first stage evolutions. Um, let's see. I'm not really into the whole double battle thing yet, but we'll see how that changes as I go on. I'm just gonna go with the special defense. Might as well. Ooh, a trainer battle, okay. Obedient Pokemon, Selfish Pokemon, Pokemon have unique characteristics. This is true. They're definitely not just lines of text and lines of, uh, lines of code. Okay, Bergmite, easy peasy. I want a Bergmite. Okay, so I'm level 11 now. I want to see what everything else is, uh, at the moment. Because I want to see how, how much of that experience is going to the others. Boy Coco's getting pretty up there now. Of course, I guess I can just get him to 16 and then move on to my knife size level. That's probably the best case until we start seeing things other than like normal types and grass types. Uh, yeah, I should definitely learn Bite uh, over... Yeah, I'm not using Rift. Hey, Dreadwig's at level 7, so he's gained two levels since we've gotten this thing, so I'm, I'm down. This works. Capsa Kid. I want a Capsa Kid. You're still just grass type though, so you're getting right to here. Cool. Cool. So far, so good. Like, this feels okay. Especially if they just keep throwing things at me that are really weak to fire. This is going to feel real good. And right now, I can only see it getting better once I get, like, Torch Song and things like that. Uh, I don't know why I'd ever use Quick Attack over Pound, or, or what, use Pound over Quick Attack, rather. So I'm just going to get Lick there. Okay, this is going well. We're Rare Candy. I guess one level is worth it. Let's see. Let's go ahead and toss it on. There, there's an argument for Turtwig. Let me do a Turtwig just to level things out in case I do need a grass type, but I do see the value as well of just keeping on Play Coco until level 16. Okay, so it crashed on me again and it took me all the way back to the Meowth, but I did everything exactly the same as I did it before. I also lowered the recording, or the lowered the volume, uh, 
of the game itself on the recording, so hopefully it wasn't too loud beforehand. Um, I can't really tell. It's super loud in my ears, but I'm just recording it all on OBS right now. Um, okay, cool. So I'm not going to swap. Let's get like go to level 16 and then talk about swapping. Um, did just get an attack lower. It doesn't matter. I'm just an ember instead. Or anyways, rather. I did reload the game as well, so hopefully that ca helps with the uh, the crashing scenarios. Okay. Um, I'm just not finding myself using the money so much right now. That's a lot for a reroll. I don't know why it went up, because I didn't use it. Uh, let's just... Uh, let's hit the nugget. See, every time that every time the save thing comes up, I think I'm about to crash because that's how it's been happening. Um, so hopefully we're good. Ooh, that's gonna suck. Oh, we're chilling though. I'm faster as well. I guess I do need to start thinking about this stuff now. If you learn protect, cool. Uh, sure. Let's get speedier. I think the X item's got to be the way to go. Chancy. I don't have much for you. We can get a burn off. No. Let's see how much the bite's doing. Bite's doing better. Hopefully, I get a heal after this. I can take one more of those as long as he doesn't crit. Ooh. Okay. So now we're definitely gonna swap. Oh wait, I can catch it. Let me swap and then catch. I forgot all about catching. Um, that might be a really good uh, catch time. Uh, Turwig, you haven't gotten much screen time. Let's get this chancy. No? Okay, let's get this chancy. No. Let's get this chancy. Okay. Alright, sorry, I keep getting interrupted. My wife just called me. Uh, let's see. Let's go to something that I don't really care about if it if it gets fainted right now. Because I do really... I think having a Chansey would be great. Or having a Blissey, even. Um, but this isn't happening. That's going to hurt in a second. One, two... Three. Okay. I think we're just... Uh, we might just be... Let me do one more. I have a good feeling about this one. It was misplaced. Um, Alright. Oh, wait. I forgot, forgot I was confused. Yeah, I'm fucked. <laughs> Oopsies. Okay, that's fine. Uh, Froakie. Okay, so yeah, I wasted a lot of shit. Um, I wasted a lot of HP trying to catch that Chansey, but it's okay. Uh, we should be able to heal up. I've got a lot of money. Incinerate. I can't remember if Incinerate is technically better than Ember or not. 40 and 60 it is. Okay, cool. So we'll get rid of Ember for Incinerate. Very nice, very nice getting levels in. Okay, so let's do potions for everybody who needs them. And then I'm going to take the... Should I take the Revive for the Lulu? Probably. The X special defense, mine's about to run out, so it might actually be good to take it, but... Uh, you know what? Let me, let me buy it. Buy the revive. So I've got a lot of money, I gotta use it at some point, and then take the X special defense. I don't know what I would be saving money for. I guess I need Pokeballs at this point, because I just took a, <laughs> took a bunch to try to catch the Chansey and failed. Uh, this is a bad Pokemon to have out right now. Let's swap out. To what level is it? Ten. Uh, <laughs> we're just gonna go back to play Coco. I, I would go between my one of my big three, but I think play Coco is actually the best one for it. Ooh, easy. Okay, so play Coco is at level sixteen. Oh yeah, and he's evolving, of course. So the weirdest middle stage evolution. I still, I still don't like Crocodile very much. <laughs> I chose Flay Coco for my for my first uh, for my first adventure through uh, Scarlet. But I guess my only adventure through Scarlet. Um, and man, I was 
really confused when Crocodore came on my screen. Um, still am every time I, I see it. Okay, Taylo. See, I want, I want these Pokemon. So let me see. I'm assuming all of the experience now goes. Yeah. Okay. I'm wondering if it's the same amount of experience that they would have gotten before I got to the level cap, or if all the experience that even Crocodile would be getting is going to them now. But I don't really know how to check that. Okay, we're going to grab some Pokeballs because I am running low. And here we go again with the disappointing Pokemon. Okay, so we are going to swap. We're going to let Froakie have some time in the sun. And I guess I'm going to try to catch this just to have a flying type. I really don't want to do too much damage to it. Oh, I'm stupid. All I, all I thought about was... All I was thinking about was uh, paralyzing it. I totally forgot that it was a normal type. Okay, so this is hurting. Why is it hurting a lot? We're going to go out to Wulu. Woo -woo. And I guess we'll try to get into the yellow at least. Now, can we get it? Dude. It's a Spearow. Thank you. Modest. That's awful. Why does it keep giving me the exact opposite of what I need? Uh, I will swap out for it, though. I told you that the is a lot in the world. Um, okay, great. So I'm just going to, this first run, I'm just going to catch everything that looks like it would be good. Oh, we got an upgrade. Um, oh, no. Wait. The charcoal would be so good, but I... You know what? Having the charcoal is probably better. So the plan was to swap out um, with, the, uh, with the leak. Or what is it? No, the baton. Swap out with a baton, get the baton pass on to another Pokemon whenever I got a bunch of Torch Song stacks uh, and was low on HP, but having just the base boost to fire types, so fire type moves might be good and it's going to help me now. So let me put that on Crocolore. Wait. Oh, wait. Was that not an item? Does it just give a base? <gasps> wait a minute. That might have just given me just a flat increase. I don't, that might not have been an item. I don't want to swap. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna look at my summary. Oh, one Pokemon could have multiple items? Wait, that's cracked. Okay, good to know. I do like that they sped up, um, they sped up the, the battle sequence a lot in this. I was just thinking now I want some speed up, but I think it'd be a little bit hard to see. Um, I'm just used to, <laughs> I'm used to being able to speed up my, uh, my ROMs to an insane amount. Okay, so let's talk about healing right now. I got to last time. Great balls. Okay, that's gonna be interesting to have. We're just gonna use all this on healing. Since heals are really the only thing that you can spend money on, I guess I'm just gonna do that. And I'm probably never gonna be taking healing, I would think. Ditto. Huh. Ditto. Well, I am gonna swap you out. Uh, let's swap out for sure for Spearow. I will not be swapping for Oki. And let's see. I want to... I think I might want to catch the Ditto just to have it. Only twice? That's weak as shit, Spearow. Transformed into Pidgey? That's interesting. Usually doesn't do the one next to it. Watch this many time he hits five times and kills it though. I totally forgot that I wanted to do that. Um, okay, so this is going to be better than Water Gun in all situations.
Razor Leaf, wonderful. Three times, okay. Uh, let's go ahead and toss a Pokeball here, see if we can grab this thing. We did. Awesome. Now, ooh, a timid one. That'd be great for breeding. Um, okay, then added it as a starter. Cool. Alright, so I don't want this thing right now. I don't think. Nah. But having it caught for a starter will be interesting. Maybe we can do a ditto only run at some point. That'd be funny. I wonder if the transformation changes in between battles. All PvP for all Pokemon. For all of one Pokemon's me. Okay. I'm not noticing any problems with PvP yet. Um, we will heal. I'm not seeing much of a reason to not stay fully healed up at all times. Um, either stores all PvP for one for all of one Pokemon's moves for one Pokemon. Alright, got it. Um, yeah, we're just gonna grab the Pokeballs here. I'm not running any issues yet. Silent. Do you think we should be calling him Ceylon? Or Cilantro? Anyway. Sorry, that's how my brain works sometimes. Um, I guess we're going to go ahead and swap out to Croc or No. I have Pack here. Let's do that. Because, if I remember correctly, Fairy versus Fire, so it can do more damage. What do we got now? What do we got? Salon. Hexage. The coolest of the shittiest Pokemon. Ooh, it has a Citrus Berry. Okay, I was gonna stay in. But you know what? It's Crocolore time. Oh, I thought I missed for a second. I was being really upset. I was like, that was a hundred percent accurate move. Okay, cool. Egg Voucher Plus. What do I do with the Egg Vouchers? I saw some other people get those, and I still don't know what you do with them. And we got healed. Okay, cool. So, this is 20. Sunkern. Well, you're terrible. I'm wondering if this is what most people... I mean, it makes sense to be running through with mainly one Pokemon, right? Because I just find myself wanting to use Crocolo all the time. PP up! Uh, I don't feel like that's worth it right now. We don't have any moves. That oh, wait, uh... Sorry, let me finish, let's finish this thought. God, my ADHD is going crazy. Um, so, yeah, I, I don't think we have anything that's worth using a PP up on right now. Uh, but that might be good for later stuff. Uh, but yeah, we got more potions and stuff here. Cool. All right, cool. Uh, great ball. Ooh, cottony. This is great. Ooh, do I want it over Turtwig though? Probably not. Um, but I do kind of want to catch it. Um, so we're gonna take a big old bite. Ooh, that did less than I anticipated. I'm gonna do a big old tackle. I'm gonna do it. That was a, not a very big tackle. Uh, let's see. One more should put it. God dang it. One more should put it in the yellow. Cool. We're gonna toss a gray ball at it. I feel like that's gonna be a really good starter Pokemon. But I am not gonna hold on to it right now. I think Turtwig is going to be better overall. More importantly, Torterra is going to be more important. Starting out with actual starters is really good. Citrus Berry. I think that's more important than a rare candy right now, honestly. Let's see Citrus Berry on... You know... It's probably going to be better long term on. No, it's going to be better long term on Crocolore. So I'm still thinking about the Torch Song stuff that we're going to be doing. Yeah, having actual starters, especially the most recent starters, is really, really strong. I 
feel like they should start you out with lower level Pokemon, like lower, lower uh, power level Pokemon instead of actual starters. Because being able to pick three starters to cover all your all the things you need is kind of insane. Okay, let me take a look here. Do you need to heal Rock a little bit? You can deal with two. Watch me die by two points though. Uh, and helping hand sucks. Hop it again. I will not switch both mine and I will burn the crap out of this one. Pleasure doing business with you. Cool. I think we'll hit the next boss battle and call this good for now. I'm play on in a bit. Uh, increase the holder's base defense by 10%. Yep. Higher your IVs, the higher the stack limit. So it does hold the item. The higher your IVs, the higher the stack limit. I don't know what that means. Um, but hey. Wait, what was this for again? Defense. You'd think I'd remember that. Uh, let's go on Turwig. Okay, she's back. Fancy meeting here. Looks like you're still undefeated. Yep. I know you're thinking, I know I wasn't creeping on you. I wasn't thinking that. It's happening in the area. It's happening. I'm happy for you, but I just wanted to let you know that it's okay to lose sometimes. It's not. I think I would actually lose the game and have to start over if I did that. I want to keep seeing it. Is there like meta progression in this besides the Pokemon, like catching the Pokemon and being able to use them as starters? Ow. You're faster than me. What was the other Pokemon they had before? Sprigatito and... I don't remember. But I think they're gonna switch here. So I'm gonna switch too. Yup. Grandpa. Not the best thing I could've swapped into. Uh, really not the best thing I could have swapped into, actually. I don't know if I have a best thing to have swapped into, though. Um, let's see how much Razor Leaf is going to do. Christ! Uh-oh. That's a lot of damage. Uh, Wooly's not going to be helpful here. Enipede's definitely not going to be helpful here. Uh-oh! Uh-oh, Stinky! Uh, we might have to pivot through one of our weakers to get, I guess, back to Crocolore. I mean, it'd be... He's the most beefed up. I don't like how much health he has. Let's go through Venipede, see if we can get a poison off, maybe. Or not. Uh, I guess that was wishful thinking. Let's hit Crocolore. I, I just don't think Crocky's going to be able to do anything. So I've got his water pulse. I could confuse, but that's a chance. What else do you have? Lick could paralyze, but he's no, he won't hit him because he's a normal type. I just don't have anything possibly for dragons, and I couldn't have had anything for dragons at this point. Oh, I could have. I had. I, there's some fairies. Okay, note to self: have a dragon check, even this early on. Okay, what do you have, Lulu? Do you have anything worth? That's an option, if I can somehow live the hit. I don't want to use Play Nice, I want to use Twister. I want to use Twister. Use Twister on me. Use Twister on me! I don't want to... Use Twister. Why am I faster now? Am I speed tied with this thing? Damn it! Oh, wait, I protected myself. Let's go. That was not worth it. That was really not worth it. Okay, we're gonna... And of course... Okay, I guess I'm speed tied with it. That sucks. Uh, okay, Croc Alert. Let's see if we can just bite this thing. Maybe flinch it. Oh, sick. Oh, I did flinch it. Flinch again. Yes! 
Good old flinch hacks. Can always count on it. Come in clutch when we need it. Okay, sick. Turtwig. I can't remember if Turtwig evolves at this point or not. Uh, I don't have anything for Pidgeotto either. Uh, so we're gonna incinerate. Shouldn't do too, too much. Sick. Uh, and there's my Citrus Berry coming in. Okay, so that definitely with that Citrus Berry, we should be good now. I don't even think Florigato can, uh, can do anything for me. This should be the level cap, 20, right? Oh, thank you, evolving. Wait, this happens in the middle of battle. Okay, so it's not time for Turtwig to evolve yet. Frogadier time. Frogadier is a very underrated uh, middle evolution, I think. I think it's one of the coolest ones. Aerial Ace. Yeah, I will take that. Uh, over heck for sure. Turtwig wants to learn Curse. I don't... I can't remember what that does for, uh... For not ghost types. I forget. I know it boosts something, but I can't remember what it boosts. So I'm not gonna worry about it. Okay. Should be chill. Nice. Okay, it was a little sketchy with the Drampa. I wasn't expecting the Drampa. I just realized Drampa's name is Dragon Grandpa. Grandpa. Drampa. Well. Hey, at least Turtwig's evolving. Grottle, not Grottle, you fucking weirdos. Okay, so that's this is where he starts getting really tanky. I think so. Should be good. Wasn't supposed to lose that time. Oh well, this means I'll have to train even harder next time. Another one of these. No need to thank me. It's the last one. You won't be getting any more freebies from me. What is it? Two EXP alls? Oh, does that boost the amount of XP that I do get? Reversal. Don't think I need it. Lumberry is pretty good. I've used my Citrus Berry, so let's go ahead and toss the Lumberry on Crocodile. Oh, I need a heal. It warned me not to do that, huh? Let me... Let me just get a heal off real quick. Just let me heal. Let me heal. Let me, let me heal. Let me heal. Okay. Uh... How much does this do? 50? 40. Okay, whatever. Maybe this, this. Okay, so yeah, I guess I'm gonna leave this off here for now. We'll continue this run and I guess another episode. I wasn't planning on really doing an episodic thing at this, um, but hey, it's fun, so might as well, right? Um, I'll just go ahead and full heal up everything. I Ooh, wait, I'm really low on money now. Oh, shit. All right, so yeah, I guess I'm going to leave this off here. Um, like I said, I wasn't planning on doing episodic stuff, but I, this is fun, and maybe you guys are into it. I don't know. Like, I'm just going to play the game and and maybe record it. All right, cool. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Peace.